Hey guys, Daniel Bates with The Real Estate Tomato, and today I wanted to show you a tool that I've really been meaning to publicize for quite a while. The site is twitterfeed.com, and despite what the name says, this is actually a product that will push a blog post um, out to both Twitter and to Facebook. But it's not just your Facebook profile. This program actually pushes things out to whatever specific uh, Facebook page you tell it to. And so as you know, with Facebook's terms of services, um, their, your, your personal profile is supposed to be non-commercial. If anyone's still promoting commercial um, business on their profile, then you really need to stop doing that for fear of, of getting your account um, deleted. And you need to replace that, or you know, you can still have your personal profile, but you need to replace that business side of things. Move that over to a Facebook page. They're super easy to set up. You know, really everybody should have one in our business because Facebook, there's so much going on in that. Um, and so this this kind of kills two birds with one stone. All you need to do is go to twitterfeed.com, sign up for an account. Um, Basically, if I go back to the uh, to my dashboard here, you'll see the accounts that I've set up here, and I can kind of walk you through it. But I've set one up for for my mymcclellanville.net site, and basically the steps are giving your feed a name, so you can give it whatever name you want, and then providing the feed URL. If you're on WordPress, your feed URL is your blog address slash feed. Really simple. So you would enter that in. You can click test, and it'll let you know that that's working. You go on to step two, and this is where you actually tell it. And so you can see here you've got, you can add Twitter. I don't even know what this one is. Ping.fm pushes out to a couple others. Hello Text and Facebook. So the big ones that I would recommend are Facebook and Twitter. And again, with Facebook, it's going to allow you to um, push your content to a Facebook fan page if you choose. Um, give you an example just to show you what it looks like. So here I am on my Twitter account, and this is a um, post that I just wrote, and it got pushed out automatically through Twitter feed. You can see it has a little Twitter feed down here. Jump over to my Facebook fan page uh, for my website, and you can see this is the post that it pushes out so in this case it gives it a little um, you know snippet of the content here um, it's not the most um, styling ones I know some of you guys might have been looking at um, or might already be using networked blogs as a solution if you're already happy with network blogs go for it but the reason I like Twitter feed is because this is the perfect example right here this is a business that I was working with trying to set them up so that things would be automated for them and um, every morning they come in and the first thing they do is when they figure out what the lunch special is going to be, they put it up on their website as a blog post. And so the problem was with networked blogs, the blog or the, the daily special, lunch special, was going out in the afternoon after they had closed up shop. And so after a lot of research, I switched them over to Twitter feed. And as you can see, that had the messages going out much earlier, you know, unless they forgot to do it or whatever. It, it, it was going out within 30 minutes of, of when they were updating it. And so um, that's why I'm a big fan of Twitter feed, um, mainly because of the timeliness. Like I said, if you're already hooked up with network solution or network blogs, then then you know keep on going with them. There's no reason to change over. But you know, Twitter feed kills two birds with one stone. You can set up the feed for Twitter and Facebook at the same time. You can organize everything all, you know, all of, if you've got multiple blogs or multiple pages that you want it to push to, you can organize them all right in here on one account. Um, and that's what I wanted to share with you guys. So again, it's twitterfeed.com. And you really don't need anything other than your social media um, passwords just to log into those. But hope you enjoy it. If you have any questions about Twitter feed or anything else, please feel free to email molly at realestatetomato.com. Thanks. Bye.